So I'm once again quitting YouTube to become a customer service representative. Yay! And now you may be wondering, Lauren, why would you ever do that? Why would you ever go from being a YouTuber to working in customer service? Like my job is just dealing with customers being upset about things. Why would I do that? Well, because I'm a people pleaser and somebody asked me to do it and I said yes. So, um... I'm probably not gonna be good at this job. I hope they don't ask me anything crazy. I'm really scared because A, I don't care about this job and B, I just wanna see people happy. And speaking of always saying yes to things, you should say yes to one, hitting the like button, but two, my new merch! Woo, can't, I'm so good at modeling. I'm not good at modeling, so here they are. Here's the new merch. This drop is fun, colorful. It's my space thought and time collection, and I'm really proud of it. So make sure you go check it out, link in the description. All right, let's deal with people's problems, hmm? Sounds fun. I spend thousands of dollars here each year. Give me a discount. Bam, that's not normally how it works. And also I don't really care because I don't get any of that money. But also I don't really care about this job because I didn't even want to take it in the first place. I just said yes, because I have a problem with saying yes to people. And so I'm going to say yes to you. Go ahead, go ahead. It's fine, 99% off. My ex used to work here. What's her number? Oh, you must be uh, Susan's ex. The one who she reported to the police and have a restraining order against to like, everything's telling me to say no to you. Oh, okay, the game, the game also only wants to say no to you. Thank God, no. Oh, I didn't have an option there. I was not becoming a part of some stalker situation, all right? I'm very sick. What are you doing here? Now I'm gonna get sick. Go away. Also, I'm not doing this because you're sick. I just, um, my, no my nose had something come out of it. <laughs> um, just get, yeah, go. Go. Please don't come to the store and come so close to me if you're sick, please. Thank you. Can I have a frequent shopper discount card? Yeah, that's actually the easy part of my job. Oh, wait. No, I told him no! <laughs> I thought the first answer was yes. So why wouldn't I give him a discount card? Me, I'm just like, nope. Easiest thing I could give you. The thing I can actually, I'm supposed to give you. Nope, <laughs> I can't do it. I'm so sorry, sir. <laughs> I don't know why. Okay, so my apartment is, um, it's lovely. Uh, we got a <laughs> book holding up our table. How's our life going? You currently are all alone. Okay, you currently have no overtime. You currently have no car. I'm doing great. All right, let's work our second job at the airport. <laughs> can I take my miniature horse on the plane? Oh no, my decision's actually like, impact the safety of other people. And I can't say no. Oh, look at her face. She's so angry. I don't want her to be angry at me. You'll just, you'll have to pay extra, okay? Pet the horse for me. I'm a celebrity. Can I have first class? Oh my God, is it Taylor Swift? Ah, <laughs> uh, it's gotta be Taylor Swift. Sure. Girl behind her's like, that wasn't Taylor Swift. <laughs> but if I say she was, then I don't get in trouble. I'm one pound over the weight limit. Can you give me a break? You know, those weight limits on the bags are for safety precautions so that the plane's not too heavy or the weight distribution isn't messed up so you know you don't crash to the ground and die. But sure, yeah, sounds good. I'm not gonna be on your plane. How safe are your planes? Now that I'm in customer service, you may die. I <laughs> just, I'm being honest with you, sir. I don't want to lie, but I have, there's a miniature pony on one plane and there's another lady that's got a bag over the weight limit that's definitely going to crash the plane. So I just, I don't. Do you offer vegetarian food? That's an easy yes. Enjoy your vegetarian meal before you plummet to your death. All right, now I'm starting my third shift at a hardware store. This drill costs less at Ace. Oh my God, it's the girl that's sick. Get out of here. You infected me twice now. Yes, whatever, get out. Oh my God, I see her again. She just came back. <laughs> I'm gonna get sick. Try it out. Wait, that's an ax throwing section? That seems safe. I set that up because somebody asked and I said, yes. Can I have your phone number? Oh no. Okay, both answers are no, so <laughs> thank God. No thanks, I will be nice though. Oh, it's sickness, girl. Date this customer? Uh, No, I want to have this customer isolated, <laughs> but I guess I'll go, I'll, I, I have to keep the customer happy. I'll go get it. Why are you sad? All right, next day, back at the grocery store. Ray was so excited today. He ripped the arms off his shirt. I'm very poor and can't afford this. Oh, Ray, is that why you pulled off your sleeves? Did you need to use them for something else? Did you have to use them for socks? All right, you take a discount, man. 
You take a discount. I hope things get better for you. Oh, hey, it's Taylor Swift. Will fried cheese make me fat? You'll never be an Instagram model, Taylor Swift. <laughs> if you eat a balanced diet, you can eat that too. Why am I a nutritionist? I'm raising money for a billionaire's presidential campaign. Do you have 20 minutes to talk? Oh God, I don't know. Uh, I don't want to listen. I don't want to listen to why I should vote for your billionaire president. Doesn't understand anything or care about anything that's happening, but I have to say yes. And now I have to listen to all of it. Ah. Ah. Oh God, it's the same guy. I don't want to talk about it anymore. He followed me to my second job. I need to change my flight. Can you do it for free? Sure, just please don't talk to me about your presidential candidate anymore. Do I really have to pay an oversized luggage fee? Nah. <laughs> Why is he mad? I said, no, you don't have to pay it. Oh my God, everything's backwards. Everybody's just getting mad at me, even though I'm telling them yes. I don't, I, I'm so confused. I'm a frequent flyer from another airline. Will you match my status? What? Why? Why would I match your status on another airline you spent a bunch of money on? But yeah, sure, what? whatever. I got a promotion for that? All right, well, just nothing's making sense now. I want to build a moat. Can you help? Yeah, sure. I'll stop by after my third job. <laughs> I'll help you. <laughs> it's fine. I'm looking for a lot of lubricant. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Stacy? Stacy can hook you up, Wink. Why are you? What? Why is she mad? I'm so bad at this. I don't understand. Can you point me to the frozen food section? Sir, this is a hardware store. <laughs> that guy is, uh, he's definitely on something. But we're not gonna worry about that. That's not my job. Can I roller skate inside? Sure. Why not? I don't know why you're mad. I just gave you what you wanted. I'm just <laughs> going a little crazy here. Will you watch my baby while I shop? <laughs> sure. Why not? Give me your kid. I'm just a stranger with a, I'm pretty sure a snake tattoo on my arm. You could trust me with your child. <laughs> What's your favorite liqueur? Why do you want to have a drink with me? Four loco. Yeah, let's get crazy. <laughs> let's get crazy. That would made her sad. <laughs> it was like, I was kind of into you until you said that you liked four loco. <laughs> totally get it. These peanuts are in a bag. I need them served on a plate. <laughs> All right, I feel like you guys are just making up stuff now. We will serve it on a plate of gold from now on for you, sir. Can you help me sneak contraband through customs? <laughs> what? Forging is my specialty. Again, I feel like all the planes that are going out under my watch are very unsafe. But I, I have to say, look how angry she's gonna be at me. I have to say yes. It's fine, right? It's gonna be fine, right? I'm definitely going to jail. I clogged my toilet. Please help. Well, that's embarrassing for you. What'd you clog it with? I mean, I shouldn't ask customers that. <laughs> Did you go to Chipotle? Plumbing aisle 15. Just doing my job, ma'am. Are chainsaws dangerous? No, Anna. I actually sleep with one every night in my bed. Just let it rip. It's fine. It's all good. Grandma has no teeth. What should she eat? <laughs> Mashed sweet potatoes. Bleach? Oh my god. I love how these are like the answers I'm thinking about <laughs> at this job. Intrusive thoughts. Because I hate this job so much. I'm not gonna kill Granny. I'm not gonna kill Granny unless she gets on one of my flights. I mean, <laughs> it's not up to me. Don't give your grandma bleach, please. Where can I get some hot buns? Right here, baby. <laughs> Oh my god, I did, I swear, I did not read the options. That's amazing. Okay, well, we're gonna, we're gonna say that because I said that before it even gave me as an option. Thanks for helping me today. Oh, you're welcome, Susan. It's my pleasure. Uh, love her. Can I bring my insect on board? <laughs> okay... That may be how all the spotted lanternfly invasive species thing happened. It was me. Another airline canceled my flight. Do you have any flights left? <gasps> yes, and then maybe you will start using us instead of the other airline, which is good for the company. Yes, we can give you free peanuts. Love us. We have to try and fix our reputation from all of the plane crashes <laughs> recently that I definitely had nothing to do with. Can you please give me 15 pillows? I'd like to make a fort. Oh, you seem like a fun person. You know what? I haven't dated somebody yet. I think I'm gonna date you. I'm gonna date you, girl. I'm gonna make pillow forts with you somewhat later. Oh yeah, we at the club. Oh, that girl over there. Let's buy her a drink. That was it. Oh, she lives with me now. <laughs> okay, well that, uh, that moved really fast. 
Okay, all right. Yeah, stop. Okay, you're smothering me a little bit, girl. Make me a pillow for it for when I get home. You sold me weed killer and it ruined my garden. Doesn't sound like me. <laughs> Let me, I will come over and I will grow you a new garden, okay? I don't have a life. I have a very clingy girlfriend at home. There she is. <laughs> I opened a brand new leaf blower and it gave me an allergic reaction. You opened my new leaf blower at home, girl? <sighs> I'll pay for your medical bills, I guess. <laughs> Even though I just met you. You're very clingy and I'm very nervous hate this customer. No, I feel like my girlfriend would murder me. <laughs> oh no, I'm calling her my girlfriend. I just met her. It's because she moved into my place within a night. Somewhat later. We're at the club again? Um, don't bother. She's probably going to be at my house anyway. Oh, she's gone. Oh, I can look around. Oh my God, she robbed me. <gasps> I work at a restaurant now. There's no customer service at a restaurant. Am I the hostess now? Do you serve? Get out. <laughs> Only for you, baby. I don't know what's happening. Which is your favorite dish? <laughs> Straight up ketchup because I'm going a little crazy from this job. Can my emotional support crocodile stand on the couch? <laughs> I want to date you, actually. <laughs> I want, I needed a, an emotional support crocodile in my life. And also, yes, somewhat later. What? What? I want, where's the guy? I don't want her. Let's give her a drink, I guess. I don't know. Hey, ex-girlfriend. Oh, but then he's in my apartment. Where's your emotional support crocodile? I was promised an emotional support crocodile. All right. Calm down. I know I'm awesome, but... <laughs> oh, there he is! Every time! My significant other just keeps coming to my place of work and I can't handle it. That man is running around naked. I'll wrangle him, don't worry. <laughs> I know I'm about to play a disgusting game. It's another thing when it just gets like shoved in my face against my will. Oh, boy. oh man. I don't even know if I want to help customers anymore. I've seen some things, Ray. If it doesn't have a price tag on it, is it free? Oh, ha, ha. Ray, hilarious. Yes, actually. <laughs> just take it. Somewhat later, I swear to God. Don't bother. I don't know. I don't want to get back together with you. Where's the crocodile man? Where's my emotional support crocodile? It would have helped me after that ad I had to sit through. I accidentally drilled a hole in my hand. Oh my God. Why is everything escalating? We will fix that hole, even though I'm not a doctor. I accidentally drilled a hole in my hand. Another person? We will also fix that hole. Welcome. We're now a hospital. I'm looking to get hammered. Well, I have some beer in the back. Uh, I guess I'll just keep saying yes. So we've come this far. Does this steak have meat in it? Okay, I'm done with this job. I'm burning everything to the ground. I need an emotional support alligator. I hate everybody! <laughs>